Impact 2022. You can do better than that. Tonight I want, I want to do something special and it is something that I do to only a particular tribe. I was talking to Pastor Eastwood the other day and he said, Papa, the sword you give to me, he will be here so you hear from him himself. And he said, I hung the sword in my office. Then he said he was dealing with some situation and he sent the staff and said, go to the office and bring the sword Papa gave me. So they brought the sword, he lifted the sword and he made some prophetic declarations to break some battles. After that, he told the protocol guy, go hang the sword back on the wall. So the guy went to hang the sword and he wasn't coming back. So after a while, he sent to find out what was happening and the guy was stuck on the wall where the sword was hanging. He couldn't pull out. So they told him and he had to go and pray to pull him out from the wall and from the sword. I want to do something prophetic in bridging the gap between one generation and another generation. Bring me the sword. It's a long, it's a long journey. But faithful is he who has called, and he also would do it. The Bible said that in Hebrews 7, 25, that he's able to deliver to the uttermost. And you must always remember that, to the uttermost. Those who came to God by him, because he ever lives to make intercession for them. The greater intercessor ever lives to make intercession for you to fulfill your mandate. Tonight, I want to hand you over a sword, which is a symbol of authority in the spirit. Whenever you lift up this sword, let heaven respond. And let heaven respond by lightnings, by thunder, by earthquake, by fire, and by mercy. In the name of the Lord Jesus, hold the microphone for me. I hand you over this sword. Let it bridge the gap between my generation and your generation. are lifted as the sword is lifted let the sword of God's deliverance be lifted over your lives and your situation and whatever that is not of God let it go down by fire I decree a new season as the people scream the sword of Gideon, the sword 